Welcome everyone, we are back, this is part 14. Today might be a shorter of an episode. Um, we are going to go ahead and finish the quest of Sigmire. And from that point we'll join, journey onto the painted world after that. So let's go ahead and begin. We have, I believe her name is Siglind. Let's have a chat with her. Oh, hello again. We're both managing quite well, aren't we? But I haven't found my father yet. Have you seen him? Yeah, we saw him. We saw him, I believe, down by the swamps. Really? Then I must be off. I'm sorry he's caused you trouble. He has a knack for that. If he just stay put. Really? I'm sorry. Okay, so... Let's go find out where he's at. For that, we're going to warp to the Daughter of Chaos Bonfire. Eh, you know, now that I'm here, might as well just kindle this bonfire, right? to where we fought the Bed of Chaos, but not her actual boss room. Just a little bit before, um, I think this is the shortcut. Where's the shortcut, actually? Oh, the shortcut's this way. We're gonna head back towards that area. You know, we didn't explore it. We kind of rushed through it a little bit. You know, that's okay with me. So we're back here where our friend Solaire was. That was weird, something took nine damage. get past this guy again. Hello, Titanite demon friend. Oh, he jumped backwards. Well, that's good. Okay, here's the lightning. Cool. Alright, first things first. Let's clear out all the baddies. This is where that Isolith witch was before. Kind of cool. The lava effect and all. Kind of makes me wonder if the Tomb of the Giants is over that way. Or over that way. Because you could see it from here. From the Tomb of the Giants, not from here. 
All right, let's have a fight at Cthulhu Man. All right. All right. Pyromancy, Chaos Fire Whip, which I believe we have already picked up. And this is where you drop for the Ketabea, Bed of Chaos. Blah. The one fight. And last time we came over here and made a gigantic mistake with our lives. I'm not, I'm not really remembering what that is, so I don't think it's really important. Just for fun. And it's our friend over there. The question is, can we reach him? Now, this is a very, very critical point in the actual quest line if you actually talk to him he'll come down and try to fight all of these by himself so what we are going to do is in the ultimate cheese fashion we are going to jump down and kill all but one of the chaos eaters I should probably equip the ring, huh? I should have equipped the ring. Oh my gosh. Oh, please don't fall in there. Oh, I went the wrong way anyways. Okay. This is uh, gonna end poorly. Let me around you. There we go. Oh, I definitely want to go down there, but not right now. Oh, man. He is hot on my heels. If I had the ring... You know what? I'm gonna quit the game out just in case. Give that guy a restart. <laughs> okay, that worked. Definitely would have been better if I had this ring. Okay, and he's still there, which is good. That's what we wanted. All right, are there any other ones? No, perfect. I believe there's one more above us, but that's okay. Perfect. Red Titanite Chunk. All right, now we just... Need to go talk to Sigmire. So, the focus here is to have him kill this all by himself, but not, I think, at least, or we jump down with him. We can't let him drop below 50% health. If he drops below 50% health, we have to quit and reload the game because. I want to be able to continue his quest line, not end it here. Hmm? Oh, ho! Oh. Excuse me, I was so absorbed in thought I just drifted away. Must be the warmth. 
Well, what's on your mind? No, don't tell me. Those monsters making life difficult for you? You need not be ashamed. We're all in the same boat, you know. I really have run up quite a debt to you. Perhaps the time has come. Huh. What does he mean by that? Um, friend, I have an idea. A good one, really. I will rush those dire fiends and you can slip away in the confusion. Please, friend. I owe you much more than this. By the honor of the Knights of Katarina, allow me to assist you. And now, I go. Don't be slow. Ah! Come on! Over here, you fiends! Perish, owl creatures! I am Zigmire of Katarina, and you shall feel my wrath! Um, was he supposed to, I think he was supposed to jump down? Oh, maybe I jumped down. There we go. Okay, I think we're good. I didn't see him take too much damage. Well, you've saved me once again. Oh, thank goodness. I'm exhausted. I think I'll have a rest. Oh, don't you worry. The ground below me is my pillow. I'll recover shortly. Um, I hope that was the correct dialogue. <laughs> I'm actually a little bit worried. I'm a little bit worried. Okay, I think we're good. Well, let's grab these items. More red titanite chunk. Soul of a brave warrior. And a green titanite shard. Alrighty, so we're going to... Come all the way over here, back to that chest that we saw. Hopefully nothing drops on us in typical Dark Souls fashion. Okay, we're good. A red titanite slab. Let's have a read. I didn't even know that thing existed. That's kind of odd. Red titanite slab. Red titanite slab for weapon reinforcement. Legendary slabs were the domains of the gods. Reinforces fire weapons to plus 10 and chaos weapons to plus 5. Legendary slabs are the heirlooms of a nameless blacksmith deity who forged the weapons of other gods. Weapons forged with this slab become rare legendary weapons. So not too much um, lore information there, but, you know, I think... We're just going to homeward bone out of here. Don't really need anything else, so. And we get poisoned again. Oh, the last one. Kind of sucks. Alrighty. So from here. We're going to go all the way to Ash Lake. It'll be quite a fun journey.
would be quicker if I had no clothes on. Yeah. I was hoping that would do the trick, but there we go. Say I don't see the Light Town uh, notification. That guy can haul. I had no idea he could. Huh. He hasn't thrown anything at me yet, so that's always good news. This is where Sigmire was last time? Or was he on that corner? Or over there? He was somewhere. Oh, another Slugman. Oh, more Slugmans. Ugh. Okay, now we're here. back on make sure that we're decently decent I guess and I will probably take purple moss clump because that's a little annoying first time I came here I was like wow that was a little anticlimactic there we go and yeah, we're good twin humanities No idea that this even existed. The Great Hollow. Now the trick will be to survive this all in one go. No guarantees though. You can already cure the crystal lizard. So we'll like this bonfire. And I'm just gonna rest here. All the places in Dark Souls, I think this is one of the coolest. Oh, I missed him. Oh, that's unfortunate. I didn't know that's where he uh, landed. Shadow. Hmm. Risky. Oh, friends of the not friend variety. Oh, no, get out. Ugh. What I should have been doing is leveling up my, my straight sword so I could actually attack. Oh, well, that sucks. There was two more over there. So I could attack those things a little bit quicker than with this gigantic weapon. All right, let's see where we go next. I can never remember. It seems too far of a drop. I can't really tell. Something, isn't it? Ok, 
Good job. White Titanite Chunk. I guess at this point I'm committed to going down, so rip me. I hope that's not too far. Almost was. Oh, 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 get out of the way, get out of the way. Yeah, there you go. There's the ladder. Eye of death. gotta hope that we don't encounter that again because that was not very fun should have uh, leveled up one of my other weapons so I could actually attack faster rather than this slow thing because once you miss your planned attack and you're kind of doomed and I don't know how I missed this last time but it's not like it was worth much so oh wait it was this way ow just happily drop down something that I didn't need to. trick is to try and jump on that branch. Nope. Alright. Let's get out of his way again. Oh, that was way too close. A 
Oh, that's a dead body. Okay. This is where I jumped last time. Nearly doomed myself. Oh, I almost doomed myself there, too. Okay. This won't do a lot of damage, unfortunately. I've been meaning to upgrade it, but... Now what the heck, we can give it a shot. At least it'll give us quicker movement. Oh, this is bad. I'm dead. There's no way. Oh. Somehow that ended up working out. Oh look, and there was a ladder here. Hmm. <laughs> Silly me. Large soul of a nameless soldier. So where does this go up? Not that it really matters. Oh. Very well hidden. Rip body. Okay, so... Now we just need to find a way out of here. Watch there be another ladder that I don't see. Ah. Probably not even worth it. Titanite chunk. Okay, those are all just dead. I don't like fighting the mushroom guys. They make me sad. No, Ulysselians, leave me alone. Hello, big mama Ulysselian thing. Oh. arrived at Ash Lake. Take care of this Hydra. Hopefully, this will be just as easy as the last one. I like how I can see his tails and everything, that's kind of cool. That's a little too close for comfort, buddy. Oh. 
Okay. So the answer to that was no. It won't be as easy as I hoped. Let's grab these. Not that I really need them. Oh, that does nothing to him. Oh, that time I didn't take any damage. What the heck? Grab a heal. Come on. Don't make me slap you with my slappy stick. Oh, that's why I died, is because I took more than one hit. Okay, that makes sense. I thought that was a head rip. <laughs> oh, so I hit the three in the middle. Ow. This is a bad place to rest. Oh, well, that was embarrassing. Come on, sail. Those aren't dodge hard to dodge. <laughs> and I missed both of them. Wow. Very, very productive. And I died right into that one instead of forward. Let's heal. Oh, I hate how slow this sword is sometimes. Get up, get up, come on. Oh man, this is going much poorer than I wanted it to go. Attack me. I had no idea that that was there. <laughs> ah, I gotta move this way then. I seriously missed that. There we go. Dragon scale. 
I might have already read one of those, but those might be my first ones as well. Nope. Must have already read one. Alrighty. I believe we can warp back here. If not, I'll cut it and journey back here. Alright, let's have a chat. Well, hello again. I have finally located my father. All of your help was invaluable to us. Thank you so much. I was finally able to pass on my mother's last words. My father, as he went on his final adventure. Don't worry, that's just the way he is. I'm dead or no. Sort of reassuring, really. If he goes hollow, I'll just have to kill him again. My father, don't... I'll just have to kill him again. And it looks like we cannot. <laughs> so that kind of sucks. Um, so yeah, I will go ahead and make that a long journey again and show you the ending of that. So bear with me. Okay, we are back. Sorry about that. I actually fell off the tree about four or five times. It's quite hilarious, actually. So, yeah, um, we are back here. So let's go and see what happened. Titanite slab. Oh, father. Dear father. <laughs> oh, father. Dear father. <laughs> and that's it. Farewell to our good friend Sigmeyer, Katarina. I don't know why that quest line of all the quest lines kind of hits me the hardest. Probably because he's one of the more comical characters. You know, he's not particularly the most useful, admittedly, but, you know, he's comical and you develop some sort of attachment to him and they, from software, does that very well. I just love Ash, like, it's so cool looking giant head of a giant giant head of a giant <laughs> a skull of a giant is what I meant to say there are speculations that this is where the pygmy Lords found the Dark Soul. Kind of an interesting theory. Well, 
not disturb the crabby mans, just let them hang out. thing to do and then we can call this an episode one of the very last everlasting dragons to join the Covenant. Dragon Headstone and a Dragon Eye. We can offer Dragon Scales to him. Let's get four. So... Let's go ahead and read those items. Um, trying to remember what it was. <laughs> oh, I'm so bad at this. There's a dragon something and the eye of something. Oh, dragon headstone and dragon eye. Dragon Headstone, stone imbued with power of the dragons, right of apostles of the ancient dragons, gain head of dragon, emit dragon breath. The dragon apostles seek transcendence of life itself, attainable by transformation into an ancient dragon. This right is only one step, but it cannot be reversed until death. And the Dragon Eye. Online play item. Find a player who has acquired a dragon scale and invade that player's world to pillage it. An art of the transcendent apostles who pray to the ancient dragons. To be alive is to be vulnerable, and the fiery gods are no exception. The apostles seek another plane of existence, which transcends life. And now we're going to do something that always freaked me out for some reason, but it doesn't get mad. The dragon greatsword. And it affects no covenant or anything, but you can't kill him, so. Dragon Greatsword. This sword came from... Ah, this sword, one of the rare dragon weapons, came from the tail of the drag of the stone dragon of Ash Lake, descendant of the ancient dragons. Its great mystical power will be unleashed when wielded with two hands. Pretty cool. Alright, so we're going to travel to Firelink Shrine. And we will call this an episode. Okay. Well, it seems as if our numbers are dwindling here. We have lost Big Hat Logan. We've lost our sorcerer. I can't remember his name. Ricket, maybe. We've lost our Pyromancer. We've lost Sigmire. We've lost Rhea. And if I had done everything correctly, Petrus would actually be gone too. And it seems like all that's left at Firelink Shrine is our sleeping friend and Patches. So it's kind of unfortunate. Well. I'd like to thank you all for this joining me for this episode. So we'll go ahead and call it here. And we'll begin the next episode by going through the painted world. So thank you for joining me. Have a wonderful rest of your day, evening, or whatever it is you're doing. And I will see you in the next episode. Thanks. Bye.